This video and every video on this channel is made possible by your support on patreon.com slash 616 entertainment. I couldn't do this without you and your contributions keep this channel alive. You can also grab an official shirt over on prowrestlingtees.com slash 616 entertainment. What's up, Dan Dans? Welcome to episode two of our Bioshock full playthrough series. I am very excited about this show. And uh, full disclosure, I am recording this before episode one has even aired. So I don't know if <laughs> that first episode was a hit. Uh -oh. You're ready now. Oh shit, okay, so this is big business. We got our first big daddy fight here. There's another little sister ahead to get the atom from her. You must deal with her big daddy first. How do we want to tackle this? Dude, I had fucking security bots out here and everything and they're all ruined. What kind of weapons do we have? We got the shotgun. We're gonna go at this guy with the machine gun. Big daddy, there's only one way to do this, pal. Dan Dan's wish me luck. Oh, we're gonna- oh, fuck. Now he's gonna run- oh, god damn it. I was just gonna say, he's gonna rush me any second now. And it did not take long, leave me alone, big daddy! No! Oh, he stunned me. I don't know how he stunned me, but he did. Alright, we need a new gun. Oh, we need to heal. We are in big, big trouble. Let's switch to the shotgun, electric buck. Big daddy, don't do it! Don't do it, big daddy! Shit! Shoot him in the head! Oh no! Reload ski! <laughs> this is high octane. Where'd he go? There he is! And... That is gonna do it. Dan Dance, we just took down our first big daddy. Holy shit. Let's loot him. $81. Alright, here. Security bot, thank you for your service. It looks like you're not doing too well, but little sister, we gotta deal with you now. No! 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 There we go. Thank you. You're welcome, little sister. Now get the fuck out of here now. Go get somewhere safe. Do you understand? Sorry, Big Daddy. Sorry you had to deal with that. Sorry, little sister, that you had to see that. But them's the brakes, pal. You understand? Six bucks on the ground. Why? Who cares? What an exciting way to open episode two of our Bioshock playthrough. Taking down our first Big Daddy. How the fuck do I get in here? Oh, can I telekinesis that shit? I can! Oh my god, I'm a fucking genius! Oh, that was exciting. I switched back to Electro Bolt, get my shotgun out, and prepared. We took care of Steinman last time, so we don't have to worry about him. Uh, the, the first episode, it was pretty obvious that I should... Oh, shit. Almost back to emergency access. Come through as soon as you get there. You got Ryan's eye now. You won't hear him coming, but he'll be there before you know it. Oh, fuck. God damn it. Telekinesis. Go ahead, throw another one. Moron idiot. I shocked him. Throw another one, dummy. Thank you. Ah, uh, we missed. Aim a little higher. Aim high, Willis. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Did we get him? Nope. He was just selling. Did that do it? Yeah, that'll do it. That second boom is always when they drop the, the grenade that they were holding. So, that is the giveaway. I don't remember what I was just talking about. Oh, yeah. It was pretty obvious that episode one would be called Welcome to Rapture, and to my dismay, I actually uh, looked for other people's full Bioshock playthroughs, and I saw that everybody calls their first episode Welcome to Rapture, but like, it's so good. What do you want me to do? I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna ruin the sanctity of <laughs> the show just because it's been done before, okay? We are gonna, we're gonna call it a day off buying a couple, uh, health packs and whatnot. And we're going the wrong way. We're gonna go this way. But Dan Dance, I hope you enjoyed episode one 
of Bioshock. I had a great time shooting that, recording that, editing that, other than when, when, than when the first take completely failed and I had to do it again. That was a little bit of a bummer, but can we open this now? Wasn't that our whole point? Oh, we gotta go up here and press the thing that we got from Steinman, right? Here we go. How about it? Security alert deactivated. Thank you for your attention. I don't know how you managed it, but you did. Come through to Port Neptune now. I'm looking forward to shaking your hand. Atlas, you better shake my hand. I did you a huge favor here. What do you got? What do you got? 16 bucks, I'll take it. What's 16 bucks get you these days? Not too much. Neptune's bounty, here we come. Now, I don't know if I trust this place. I don't trust... A, a great man once said, I don't trust like that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Now you had the pleasure of Andrew Ryan's company. He's the one who built this place. And he's the one who ran it into the ground. Nobody knows exactly what happened. Maybe he went mad. Maybe the power got to him. Maybe he just decided he didn't like people. Whichever way you slice it, good man died. My family's in a submarine hidden in the foundation of Fontaine Fisheries. I'll meet you there. Now we gotta head to Fontaine Fisheries. I'm ducking down because I heard somebody somewhere, you know what I'm saying, and I'm not talking about that famous song you're thinking of. <laughs> Eugene swap. This is where we can swap out all of our stuff. Okay. A bolt of electricity. Okay, so we only have two. Or do we? Telekinesis, we can... Ah, fuck. What happened? So we can swap telekinesis out for incinerate. I think we are gonna do... Th oh, but teleke... Like, incinerate... We're gonna stick with telekinesis for now. And I'll tell you why. What a great little tune that is. It's because that's a that's a uh, prototype Big Daddy right there. He looks different than the other one we saw. Um, telekinesis. Oh, look at the shadows. Telekinesis can be used to grab things that are all over the place. Things that would otherwise be out of reach. Incinerate does damage, but it doesn't even stun people, you know? Where uh, the lightning... Electro Bolt will at least stun people. 91 days since our last incident. I don't think so. Oh, dude, look at the corpse. What a bad day for that guy. There's another one over there. It's about to be a bad day for, for this person right here. Oh, maybe it's going to be a bad day for me. Because they went up into the ceiling. And they did this. Oh, shit. But, yeah, I can't... Oh, fuck you. Where are you, you fuck? Oh, I'm gonna get you. Don't you worry. Days go by like wind. I can't help but think... Uh, not think, but wonder... How the first episode of the Bioshock show did. I hope it was a big hit! Ooh, big daddy time! I don't, do we, we don't have to fight him right now, technically. We could wait and fight him later when we're maybe a little more prepared. I do know, I think there's enemies up here. Maybe I can convince them to fight the big daddy. That is a strategy that you can use down the line. Can I interact with this fish at all? How the fuck did he get in here? He must have been down there, you know what I mean? Um, Give it to me. I just heard bad guy. Where was he? Is he in here? I heard somebody's trying to fuck on me. That's what I know. But um, are they? They're fighting out there, aren't they? They are. Okay, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna let those guys wear down the big daddy as much as. Oh, he took care of him already, didn't he? No, 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 he's still alive. Okay, you guys fight. And then I'll go after the big daddy. That's the move. Right? Oh, no, he, he killed that guy already. All right, well, we're gonna go this way. <laughs> Fingers crossed that that first episode of Bioshock didn't bomb. Because you know what fucking bombed, unfortunately, was the life and death of Motorstorm. Uh, that is the worst performing retrospective I've ever made. 
Um, I was very proud of it. Still proud of it. I think it turned out very well. But, um, yeah, performance-wise, that, that ain't shit, unfortunately. Bang! Take you out, sucka. Boom! That should do it, right? Yes, sir. Um, so if you watched The Life and Death of Motorstorm, thank you very much. I greatly appreciate that. If you have not checked it out yet, I highly recommend you do so. It's pretty fucking good. <laughs> so, bam! How about it? One shot and done! Give me the pistol. I don't want to waste all my shotgun ammo. You know what I mean? But I, you know, that's, uh, that's part of the risk. When you branch out into topics that... I could do this by myself. Oh, come here, you fuck. Shit! Wrong one. I need, I need Electro Bolt. No, 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 I need Electro Bolt. There you go, sucker. There, how about it? Try and survive that, dummy. That's part of the risk. When you, um... When you branch out into new topics. You know, my bread and butter is obviously wrestling and Mortal Kombat, but... Uh, things are gonna keep evolving around here. That's not gonna stop, so... One failure is just one little bump in the road, and I have... I'm, I'm so excited, like... That, like I said, bump in the road, and I'm so excited about some of the shit that I'm gonna tell you guys about soon. Um... For all of you who really enjoyed the history of Halloween and you wanted to see me cover more horror movies, that is, uh, that's something I'm working on. Here's why we stuck with telekinesis, pal. Bam! How about it? I have cooked up an idea for a horror movie review series. Not a one-off. Not a little something that I do one time. We're talking about a new show. And to coincide with my goals of growing the subscriber base and growing the Patreon, it's going to be one of the... Uh, it's going to be an upcoming Patreon goal. Sort of a... Uh, once we can attain a new level, then I'm going to start producing that show. And I'm really excited about it. I hope you guys are too. So... That is... Uh, I came up with a really cool fucking name for it, <laughs> so I can't wait to tell you guys about it. We need to go up here. That's what we need to do. Where's... They're pointing me in this direction. Are we... We're looking for the door behind this, right? You can blame a lady who craves variety. Variety? Be careful with that. You might wind up with a motor storm retrospective. <laughs> Never a good sign. They're loading me up with, um, with first aid kits. And one day the gentleman stopped calling. The gentleman pulled out a machine gun. <laughs> That's what he did. He didn't just stop calling. He pulled out a machine gun. We will take the, you know what, we'll heal and then we'll take that. Pistol rounds, thank you very much. Who is it? Atlas Radio hold on ahead. Says you're looking for an invite to the fisheries. Nuts, I say. But if in your heads up to the Warp Master's office and find old Peach a research camera, maybe I could manage an invite. God damn it. What, what was that? My friend, you are fucked. Oh yeah? What are you? My rose! I want it back! I want it back! Then come get it! Come get it! You want it back? Come get it! BAM! You think I forgot about the one-two punch? BAM! How about it? Atlas taught me well, you dummy! Shotgun! Bang bang! Oh fuck. Alright. She's pretty gnarly. She's gnarlier than I thought. <laughs> oh man! Is she gonna run away? Ooh, telekinesis! Oh dude, my security bot! Gorgeous. You'll find something to keep you alive. Now, go get that camera and then snapshots of those that crawl on the ceiling. Then I'll let you into the visuals. 
Just remember, sonny friend, I smell an ounce of Fontaine on you, and I'll have you in a b b box. Atlas gives you the vouch, but I ain't turning my eye just on his say-so. So that guy did us a huge solid. Oh man, jump with the ghosts. Fontaine's dead, and everybody knows it. In the ground for months, and half the place still jumping at his shadow. Christ, even Ryan. <laughs> you never mind all that. We got work to do. Oh, you dummies. Hold on, hold on. Oh, yeah. Oh, fuck. Oh, we, oh, no, dude. We went from oh, yeah to oh, fuck real quick. I thought I was so slick. I was like, I'm gonna shock him, I'm gonna shotgun him. And that went to hell real fast. All right, well. That one guy said Fontaine was still alive. I don't know about that. You know what I mean? What's going on over here? I think... Okay, we don't, we don't know the... Oh, we can hack that. Let's hack this. Definitely not gonna buy it out, because money's hard to come by these days, you know what I mean? <laughs> We're gonna pop that over here. Buy ourselves some insurance. Make sure everything's on the up and up. And it is. Things are looking pretty good for the Dandans right now. You know what I'm saying? Boom. Pop that up there. Now we need an up right. There it is. Up and right. Bingo. How about it? Now, what do you got for me? Other than this flopping trout. Smuggler's crate. Oh, doesn't that remind you of Skyrim? We don't need to listen to that right now. I don't know if you guys want to uh, keep listening to these because uh, episode one hasn't aired yet, so I didn't get your input. But if you didn't get a good look at uh, what's going on here, this guy was obviously uh, hooked up to the car battery and shocked to death. How'd they get a car battery down here at the bottom of the ocean? That's for you to find out. <laughs> now, we need to... Who's shooting? I do the shoe sting. You don't do the shoe sting. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Man, Dan Dan's. You know what I've been playing in my uh, in my downtime, which I don't have much of. I actually made a post about this just today to date this recording. I've been playing uh, when I have some time to play what I want outside of these shows. I'm playing Elden Ring. Oh fuck! The big daddy's mad! Oh dude! I'm a genius. I picked up that fucking uh tank of whatever and I threw it at him and I cooked him. Sorry, Rosie, you're looking like Freddy fucking Kruger over here. No, 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 no. Mm. How about it? You have shown kindness to my little one, but are you really a friend to us? Regardless, a little one brings you a gift to demonstrate our appreciation. Tenenbaum wants to reward you. The reward will be inside a teddy bear at Gatherer's Garden, which I'm pretty sure there's one right on the other side. Yep, there she is. She's setting it up. You get out of here. It's not safe here. You go. Don't be glitching up on that bear. What do you got for me? Adam, hypnotize Big Daddy! Oh my goodness, this is so useful. Oh no! Okay, well, now we're gonna swap out telekinesis. Cry out for Big Daddy's help. Make him think you're a little sister. Watch as he fights to protect you. That can be so useful. When the time comes. Gatherer's Garden. Okay. Eve upgrade. Um, health upgrade. Plasmid slot. Do we buy a pla- Oh yeah, we're gonna buy a plasmid slot. It's only a hundred bucks. Or a hundred Adam. Light up foes to a thousand degrees. Warning, fire spreads. 
We already had Incinerate, so like that's not anything crazy. But I I love those graphics so much that I just wanted to I wanted to hear it. Eve upgrade, so maximum amount of Eve. We can buy Enrage, Sonic Boom. Creates a decoy that draws attacks away. Freezing is not that useful in my opinion. Reduces all physical damage. That's what we're gonna take. Motherfucker. All right, what should we replace? We are gonna replace Wrench Jockey, which may be a good idea, maybe it's not. Machine Buster, no. Reduces flow speed when hacking. Okay, we don't need to buy any of this right now other than a health upgrade. Uh, and an Eve upgrade. Because we don't have enough slots, and I'm not going to spend a bunch of money on slots for stuff that's not that important yet. You know, it's all about the fucking strategy. Now, what's this? Pistol rounds, I'll take it. And speak of the devil. Even my pistol. But as I was saying before that big daddy tried to fuck on me, uh, I'm playing Elden Ring, and I am playing Injustice 2. Now, fuck! Hold on, we gotta deal with this son of a bitch. Electro Bolt! Oh, shit! There's a whole gang of them. Grenade launcher time. Boom! <laughs> We're not playing. Did that get everybody? You're goddamn right it did. There's a time and a place to take it slow, and that wasn't it. You all understand. I'm playing Elden Ring! And I'm playing fucking Injustice 2. Now, I mentioned the Patreon earlier, and if you are uh, signed up over on patreon.com slash 616entertainment, and you wanna watch me play Elden Ring or Injustice 2, well, you're in luck, because I just uploaded Let's Plays of both of those games. Now, why did I upload both of them? Uh, it's because I put up a poll, and I asked the patrons which game do you want to see more, and the poll closed at a tie. So rather than put up another poll for a tiebreaker, fuck it, I'll just do them both, you know? A little extra bang for your buck, how about it? But I want to know in the comments, are any of you playing Elden Ring? Um, are any of you playing Injustice 2 like I am? I also started an Injustice 2 guild. And if anybody wants to join it, go to the community tab on YouTube because I put the information there. For anybody who wants to join, you can. It's wide open. Now, this is a lot of trouble. I hear bad shit. Hypnotize Big Daddy. It's time. Oh, yeah. Big Daddy, take care of him. What the? Where's the Big Daddy? Did I miss? I must have missed. Because he didn't do shit. But yeah, I've had such uh, an itch to play Injustice 2. And guys, for the longest time, all I wanted out of Injustice 2, obviously my main is Superman. Um, all I wanted was, oh, that motherfucker's throwing grenades down there. You fucking asshole. I just wanted to unlock the chest piece for Superman. The Kingdom Come symbol and the New 52 symbol. That's all I wanted. And I couldn't fucking get them. Like, the, the random, the loot boxes and shit. It just wasn't happening for me. Who the fuck? You, asshole. Don't shoot it. I want... I wanted to hack it. Well, there goes that. Uh, I keep getting interrupted. All I wanted were those two symbols. I got them both. And that feels good. I got them both in a matter of like 10 minutes once I started playing again, which is insane because that's all I was grinding for before and they just would not pop. But my Superman is top level and I decided, you know what? I'm going to branch out. I started playing with the Flash. I started playing with uh, the Ninja Turtles and I love the way the Ninja Turtles feel, guys. Oh, fuck you! They feel so good. Their combos are fucking so simple. Because I'm not very good at the game, you know? <laughs> so, like, easy combos are my bread and butter. Because why wouldn't they be? And the Ninja Turtles just feel fantastic. I don't know. Are our balls feeling big right now? I feel like our balls feel big. 
big enough to take out this big daddy. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna risk this. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm so fucking smart. I'm gonna drop a mine here and a mine there. And now I'm gonna switch to grenades. So what's gonna happen is I'm gonna shoot, fuck. I'm gonna shoot him with a grenade. He's gonna try to come get me and he's gonna hit both those mines, but we're gonna be ready with our machine gun. Go ahead, go ahead, hit him. Come on, smarty, boom. Oh, that didn't work as well as I wanted it to. Gotcha. Missed him with that one, but that's okay. Oh yeah, we have taken down three big daddies on this episode. Are you out of your mind? Thank you, mister. You're welcome. Thank you. I said you're welcome. Now get out of here. Go get to a safe place. What you got for me, Rosie? 46 bucks? That's all you got? 46 bucks? I hear another big daddy. Where is he? There's a, but you know what? Oh, I got rid of hypnotized, didn't I? Come on. Are they not standing in water? I guess they're not. All right, well, we're gonna switch to the pistol and take out these guys from afar. Because I don't wanna keep dicking with them every time I'm in this general area. Do you understand? I'm not gonna keep dealing with that. They can go fuck themselves. I really, oh, that's a fucking, uh, that's a plasmid down there. We're gonna get that in a little bit. I should not have put away hypnotized. That was a bad idea. But it's all—it's in the past. We already did it. I got the one and only Patches Lugosi sitting here with me. If anybody wants to give him a shout out, I'll tell you that you did. I'll tell him that you did. He says, you can't even speak. You gonna tell him what I said? <laughs> Hack time. Here we go. Swap that out. Give me a horizontal. There we go. That is gonna buy us some time. Give me a vertical. There's a vertical. Boom. We're in good shape. We need one of these. We need an up left, there we go, and switch. I need a horizontal, and I need one more horizontal. That's gonna do it! Bang! Nobody can stop us. Give me the first aid kits. Give me as many as you have. We are pretty good otherwise. Give me some grenades, actually. And now, we're feeling pretty good. Wait, there's a camera! Where is it? We gotta deal with this camera. Dan Dans, did any of you watch Bioshock? It's too high to fucking hack. So we just gotta get rid of it. Wasted a little bit of Eve there, but it is what it is. What do you got for me? Nothing. Good thing I chased you all the way down the fucking stairs. Did any of you watch the first episode of Bioshock? And having never played it before, say, you know what? I should play this. If you did, let me know in the comments because I would love to know that I am helping spread the word of one of the greatest games of all time. And some of you might be thinking, who the fuck do you think has never played Bioshock and you're gonna be the one who makes the difference? Listen man, there are people all the time in my comments who tell me on like very well known games. And they say, like, you know what, for whatever reason, I just never got around to this. Boom, how about it? They'll say, for whatever reason, I never got around to this, but after I watched you play it, I, I went and bought it. So, even though the, the Motorstorm retrospective did not perform well at all, there were a number of comments from Dan Dans who said, I've never played these, and I went and bought it, and it was super cheap. So... That's always, a uh, oops. The research camera looks just like one you'd see topside. According to this magazine article I scrounged up, it can also analyze genetic information, parse biological structures, and lots of other $5 words. 
What am I looking for? I need this. There we go. Get over there fast! Gotcha. A lot of hacking this week, huh? I think there was probably a lot of hacking last week and I just skipped a lot of it. We need... Fuck, we're running out of time here. Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah, that bought us plenty of time. Make sure we got a clear path. We are golden. Here we go. But, yeah, I always love hearing that. I love hearing that some of you guys discovered or just gave another chance to a game based on one of my videos. I love that, uh, that feeling, so. Always let me know if that was the case for you. Son of a bitch! Stop attacking each other! I don't have time for this. Buy out. Hack. Buy out. Okay. Are we good now? Is everybody gonna fucking get along? Who's shooting who? Oh, see, that's why. There's big bad bullets over there. That's why all these bots are here, because they knew I was going to need help. There is a dead Big Daddy here. Give me everything you got. Where'd they all go? There's more of them, but I don't know where they are. Oh, there they are! Yeah, my rocket launcher's doing the deal! Anybody trying to fuck over on this side? I'll flank them. Oh! <laughs> That did not go according to plan. All right, so I hear a big daddy off in the distance. We, shit, we're gonna take care of you. I'm not paying 65 bucks to hack that, fuck you. I'm a good enough hacker to do it myself. <laughs> not in real life. I don't know what the fuck's going on with computers of any kind in real life. Completely helpless in that regard. You guys want to know something funny? To this day... Man, this one was almost completed for me. To this day, I don't know how to torrent a movie. Or a fucking album or a game. I have no idea how to do that. That Big Daddy is getting close, wherever he is. I also hear... Fuck! A splicer! Oh, that, you love to see that. Taken care of? Yes, sir. What a fantastic feeling that was. That was a plan coming together. Yeah, I don't know how to torrent shit. Never learned. Uh, not interested in learning. Maybe I am, I don't know. DM me on Twitter. <laughs> but, uh, no, never in my life have I ever torrented anything. I'm sure some of you are like, how do you live? How have you lived over 31 years on this planet and you've never torrented anything? Look, pal. I don't know how. <laughs> Who's shooting me? Oh, okay. Rocket bot, you, you take care of that. You take care of that. I'm not fucking... I don't think it's necessary to hack another security bot over here. There's no way. Give me that. Give me that grenade. Give me that first aid kit. Patch, we're looking pretty good here, huh? But like I asked before, if anybody's playing uh, Injustice 2, I want to know what you're working on. Who is your main? Oh, fuck! What kind of outfit are you trying to put together? That's all interesting to me. With my, with my Flash character... Oh, shit. Got him. I'm fucking. I'm not dealing with that. <laughs> with my Flash character, I'm trying to make him look like traditional Flash, but for the skin, I put on the the nth metal design because that kind of looked like the new 52 Flash to me. So I'm kind of mixing and matching. Let's crack open this safe. Because there's usually pretty important stuff in a safe, right? Why wouldn't there be? If it, if it wasn't important, why would you put it in a fucking safe? And, while I'm at it, why don't I ask you guys for some more input? Is this hacking stuff boring to you guys? Would you rather I fast forward this in the editing process? Let me know. I'm all ears. 
I'm not saying I'm gonna do that. <laughs> but if this is uh, if this is not a fun part of this show for you, if it's tedious, then we'll see what we can do. What's in the safe? Pretty good shit, as I suspected. Now, let's get back to business. What is going on over here? Give me my wrencheroni. Bang! Not wasting a bullet on that shit, you know? I hear a, no I hear a camera somewhere. Is that red light coming from a camera? It's possible. So we're gonna head through here carefully. No, I don't think that's from a camera. So I think we're good. We're gonna loot the area to the best of our ability. Is there anything in here we need? I don't think so. Gene swap. I should grab telekinesis, but I'm not going to. Uh, I'm just gonna ignore it and then regret it. <laughs> oh, I hear somebody. Jesus loves me, this I know, for the Bible tells me so. Little ones to him belong, they are weak but he is strong. I don't trust like that. We thought we could hide from the light down here, we were wrong. So, this is the camera we were after. That's a first aid kit. Oh, two of them. How about it? With the research camera, you can um, take photos, as you can see, of the different enemies. And as you take... Oh, fuck. They're going to make me do that, aren't they? Here we go. Take pictures of enemies with the camera to research them. Each enemy type has a unique set of research bonuses. Try taking a picture of the splicer on the other side of the window, keeping the subject centered and nearby. Oh, oh man, look. You can watch the camera. Oh, oh, Give me some snap snaps of those spider splicers. And don't come back down here till you cut my research. So... Taking photos, you'll get graded. So we got an A, because we're close, he's centered, it's looking good. Now, we will do more damage to this enemy because we've researched them and we know more about them. See, spider splices are vulnerable to anti-personnel rounds. So, can we double up on you? That's a C, because we, are, we're, we already photographed this enemy. Get a little artsy with the angles here, huh? Can I keep going on him? Oh no! Well, we are gonna have to switch over to our pistol and our anti-personnel rounds, which we have three of. Great. Oh! I was gonna say, please don't let anybody try and attack me uh, until my bots can help me out. Shit! Holy fuck! Where'd he go? Fuck you, pal. Who do you think you are? My bots are doing good work over here, I hope. Right? I don't know where they are. Oh, they're outside, aren't they? Or, wait a minute. Did this just happen? Did this explosion just... Ooh, what's that? <laughs> Are those pesky security cameras getting you down? Simply tag your enemies with our photoelectric insects and these cameras and turrets become your best friend. Splice security bullseye today! Okay, so I guess that's, is that like an auto hack? I don't really remember. I'm not concerned with that. I am just gonna say, fuck you and fuck you. I'm not dicking with all that bullshit. You got me? <laughs> I am not taking up a useful pass. We're just gonna abandon that sentence because that didn't work out. Machine gun rounds, take everything we can get. I'm pretty sure we want to head down here. They opened this shortcut for a reason, so why would we ignore it? 
give me everything you got. Huh. I don't, I don't trust like that. There's something, there's something else going down here that's fucky. Whoop. Get to cover it immediately. Do you like that? That was some fucking James Bond shit right there. Let's listen to one of these. Alright, I fucking held down X twice and it didn't work. So we're not gonna listen to that one. <laughs> Where are we supposed to go? We're supposed to go... What's that? What's that? <laughs> There's stuff catching my eye everywhere. Through here? Let's listen to this one. If things were bad enough, it seems that even our water system sprung a leak. Yep, that's right. The irrigation system in Arcadia is taking on seawater. I told Mr. Ryan when we were... You have the research camera? Good. Guess it's time to get to work for old Peachy. Take the man's pictures, and let's get the hell out of this place. Oh, fuck. Alright, I forgot we can't go back to, um, what's his name until we take the photos. So, we need some photos. That's a nice photo. B! Get the fuck out of here. But, it, it filled up a full level for us, so I'll take that. But at the same time, go fuck yourself. Alright, I guess we're gonna hack it. <laughs> I thought I could like two-shot that thing. Go ahead. Everybody come over here. Smile for the fucking camera. Look at that! Centrifically focused. Shout out to Mark Boardshard. Leadhead Splicer, give me the A. All these fucks are vulnerable to anti-personnel. Ooh, can I take a photo of my own security bot? Maybe not, because it's not, like, technically an enemy. But we're- oh yeah, man. We're, we're making good progress here. Let's listen to another one. That's, uh, um, that's unfortunate, wouldn't you say? We need photos of the spider splicer. There we- there's one. Come here. Oh, I don't know where it went. I don't know where it went. Fuck. Oh, no! This is going to hell in a handbasket. Fuck you! Why didn't I take a photo of you? <laughs> Fuck you, too! I need a spider splicer. I don't need any of you leadhead fuckers. The death penalty and rapture. Councils in an uproar. Rights in the streets, they say. But this is the time for leadership. Action must be taken against the smugglers. And contact with the surface exposes rapture to the very parasites we fled from. You stretch necks or a small price to pay for our ideals. Oh man. I need not a lead head, I need a fucking spider splicer. I also need more film. That was a big problem from before. Not from before. I'm just saying I noticed when I had the camera out. I didn't have a lot of film. We tricked you, monster. You tricked me? What the fuck does that mean? Oh shit! There you are. Oh, come on, dude. That's a fucking A. That's looking good. Multiple subjects? Who else is in this photo that I don't see? 
There we go. Spider splice your organs can be used like first aid kits. Beautiful. I'm gonna double up on her a little bit. Now I'm gonna switch to my shotgun and put her away. You understand? Oh no, come on now. There we go. That nearly went awry. Oh yeah, spider splicer organs used like first aid kits. That's what we like to hear. Give me the film, give me all the film you've got. I love this fucking game. Oh fuck, I don't love that camera. I love that money. <laughs> We're gonna take care of that camera real quick. Just like this. <gasps> oh no, those were anti-personnel rounds. Oh, I'm a stupid idiot bitch. I forgot I had the fucking anti-personnel rounds equipped. Well, those were important, and uh, now I don't have any of them. So, that's not good. But we got some film. That was good. Nothing in there. Any other cashola hiding around here? Shotgun shells. What's that? What is that? What is that? Arcadia Merlot. A little bit of liquor. You know what I'm saying? What's that? Armor piercing. I think we have... Yeah, we have too many of those. Alright. We need to photograph... Another spider splicer. Give me that film ski dog about it. I don't need anything out of that machine, so I'm going to ignore it. I'm half expecting someone to try to come and fuck on me from over in this direction. But I don't see anyone. So we're going to check things out over here. Fuck you! Oh! I need a picture of you. Come here! I'm sorry! <laughs> That's a B, not enough. Double up on ya. All right, I think that we will be done. <laughs> Getting a little hairy here. I'm not talking about the Henderson, you got me? That's a dated reference. Nobody knows what the fuck I'm talking about. Harry and the Hendersons, how about it? What are we looking for? A spider splicer. Let's give this a listen. I met Ryan the day me and the lads were installed in the bathroom plumbing up in his posh park avenue digs. The thought of me wife and child hiding in that filthy submarine makes me blood boil. Help me get them to safety, and I'll be in your debt for life. Alright, well, he interrupted that thing that we were trying to listen to. Um, and I don't know if he just interrupted right there. <gasps> What's that? <sighs> Fuck. Can I do this quietly? Yes. Where'd that other one go? There was a third one. That's three in one shot, brother. How about it? That is gonna fully research the leadhead splicer. So now we got a new physical tonic. Splicing scrounger is like having a sixth sense. You'll spot things you'd otherwise miss and discover things you'd otherwise leave behind. With scrounger, you'll swear you have x-ray vision. Um, I guess we'll equip that, because we had nothing else equipped right there, but more importantly, BOOM! Give me a fucking... there we go. <laughs> I was gonna say, give me a usable fucking weapon for this situation. There we go. What is going on here? This has been eventful, man. We're taking down Big Daddy's left and right. We're taking out that camera. <laughs> and we are nearly fully researched on the spider splicer. 
And as always, Dandans, I am curious about what you want to see on this channel. I know everybody likes 616 Nitro because um, you guys like wrestling content, and I understand that. It's kind of the bread and butter around here. Do you want to see another weekly wrestling game show on this channel? Because if you do, maybe that's an idea I'm playing with. Maybe that's another Patreon goal that I will announce shortly. You never know. You gotta tune in for these things and find out. You got me? Let's take a listen. Rapture's changing, but Roy can't see the wolves in the woods. This Fontaine fella. He's a crook and a proper tea leader, but he's got the animal. And now he's in the gun. Sinking the profits back into bigger and better plasmids. Building them Fontaine boy Fontaine recruits. We know it. Both gonna have a, an army of splices. We're gonna have ourselves a whole heap of miseries. Who's there? Huh? Son of a fucking bitch. I came in here for nothing. What is that? Unless there's something good in this safe. Which I sincerely hope there is. Also, oh, we're fucked. You see that? This is what I'm talking about. Look, very, go ahead and pause it. We were fucked from the very start right there. There was no way to make that work. Let's try again. I need... Okay, we are in big trouble still. And I'm not talking about little China. Do you understand? We need... Uh, we need this! Now we need this! Now we need... Shit! Shit! Oh no! We're fucked again. No! God damn it. All right, fuck that safe. I'm so mad. I am so upset. I'm gonna take it out on you. Who's out here? Asshole. Idiot. There's another one. Where are you? I hear you. You think I don't hear you? Where are you? Yeah, good idea. Open the fucking door. You think I don't see you over there, asshole? Smile, fuckface. Oh, you're a leadhead. I don't need you. Shit. Alright, alright, alright. You know, this is what happens when you get a little too cocky. <laughs> Things get out of hand. That guy is without a head. You know, these, these are the issues that we deal with. Give me all that. Every little fucking bit of it. Now, I could have sworn earlier in this episode we heard a Big Daddy and we never fought him. So he's still around here somewhere. Ooh, I need a picture of you. Oh, turn around! Oh, action shot. Okay, they gave us an A. How about it? And I'm actually gonna double up on her. Triple. Why not? You know, you gotta get in where you fit in. If I can fill two bars off her, I'll take it. We did it. <laughs> little cheapski. Little cheapski. That's the worst fucking photo there's ever been. No one's ever taken a worse photo than that. But now, she'll never take another photo again. <laughs> She dropped a grenade and I thought it was going to blow, so I backed up. And it didn't go. Can you guys hear Patches Lugosi getting up and shaking his ears around? What a goof. Five credits, what you got? Man, this is gross. There's minging ass water all over the floor. Probably doo doo water, you know what I mean? <laughs> Fuck, are we- I forgot what we're doing. What's our goal? I don't remember. Oh, yeah! We- we- we got the research, and now, we gotta head back to, uh, the guy who wouldn't fucking let us in. Before. Oh, son of a bitch. 
That's the big daddy that I was talking about earlier. I don't think I have any proximity mines left. Yes, I do. I have one. And this guy's gonna find out what it's all about. Hey, big daddy. Hey, big daddy. Huh? What do you think about that? Come get me, sucker. Come get me, sucker. Big Daddy thinks he's so great. Well, I think he fucking sucks. Who the do no? If you guys have seen Haggard, you get that reference. If you have not seen Haggard, you don't. That proximity mine is gone, and he is. Oh no! Big Daddy's still alive. Oh shit! One more, one more. Got him. Holy fuck, four big daddies down in this episode. Thank you. Thank you. Go get somewhere safe. I always feel the need to tell them to go somewhere safe because I don't want them to get hurt. They're little kids, you know? I don't want to see the little kids get hurt. It's actually impossible to hurt them, so there's really nothing to worry about. But, um, you know, I'm pure red hard. What are you gonna do? I'll tell you what we're gonna do. We're gonna hack. Shit! We're gonna hack this here machine. And I need that piece. And now I need. <gasps> we're fucked! Son of a bitch! I need to hack this thing, because I need to buy fucking, um, health kits out of it. That's why I'm hacking it. Give me a down left, for the love of fuck's sake. Give me this. Oh no. Oh no! Oh no! <gasps> oh god, we can save this. We gotta be able to save this. Give me another vertical. Boom. Holy Christ. This is exhilarating, man. These are trouble. Give me one more horizontal. How about it? We fucked up once. But that wasn't enough to keep us away, alright? We're in good shape. We filled up our um, health kits. And now we're back in business. We're gonna deliver the research. My wife, Myra. She's a right man. I heard a scream, but I don't know where it was from. Was it a spider's spider splicer? Cause I I don't know if we did the whole deal on spider splicers. I think we might need. Fuck! You're a leadhead. You're useless. Dealt with. Done. Who's fucking throwing deals? Huh? Who's throwing deals? Show yourself. You idiot bitch. Listen, you're gonna die now or you're gonna die in five seconds. Those are your eyes. <gasps> that was a big daddy. Oh no. I was not prepared for this. Oh god damn it. Why? Oh no. He fucking fucked on me with his goddamn mine. Oh, if I had telekinesis, I could throw his own mine at him! I knew I was gonna regret the fucking decision I made. I knew it. And here we are. In the fucking flesh like Gary Royce. Oh no. Anti-personnel, are those good for these guys? I don't think so. I think we need fucking armor piercing. Do we have that? We're gonna go electric buck to slow him down. Fucking shit. He's far away. Turn the corner here. Gotcha! Gotcha! 
Oh no. Oh no. Come on, bitch. Come on, Saku. Oh! <gasps> Got him. You see what just came in handy right there? That was our static shock that we equipped earlier. What kill? Ooh! What killed him was the shock wave of electricity that went off after he hit us. Oh man, that came in handy in a big way. Give me that. What what I what I do need is a fucking health kit. And you know what? I think that was for nothing. Where are the where's the little sister indicator? I don't know. I think we did that for nothing. I think we already taken care of all the little sisters here. So we just fought that guy and there's not even a little sister to, to fuck. Ah, not to fuck. I ex I interrupted myself. That's not that was not that thought. That was not that sentence. That was an incomplete thought. <laughs> You know what I mean. We're just gonna move on. <laughs> Son of a fucking bitch. Well, we just... Oh, we, just, we bought all those first aid kits. And then we spent them all on him. What a goddamn bummer. And it's not an RPG. It's not like we fucking... Thank you. It's not like we fucking leveled up for taking him out. The Little Sisters Orphanage. In trouble time, give your little girl the life that she deserves. Boarding and education free of charge. After all, children are the What's this? Wrench Lurker. When fighting those strange, stronger, or fast... Take two. When fighting those stronger or faster than yourself, you'll need every advantage possible in a scrum. Wrench Lurker allows you to make the most of your opportunities when your antagonist is caught off guard. Alright, well, I don't want that right now. Um, my, my guns are more useful to me in this moment than the wrench is. And we are, we're not starving for ammo. Oh, bitch! We're not starving for ammo, so we can afford it. There we go. Fully research the spider splicers. Shotgun switch. Bam! How about it? Come here. Where are you going? Huh? Where are you going? Where are you going, tough stuff? Come on down! Oh shit! We gotta avoid the hooks. They're throwing those goddamn hooks. And it's too dark. Now I lost her. I don't know. Oh, you bitch! I saw you running! Idiot! <laughs> she thought she could escape into the night. That's fucking weird. Oh, did you hear what he had the nerve to say? They go down easy after you research them. Then why don't you fight them, fuckface? I need a down left. There we go. Now, we just need to hope there's a clear path over here, which I am concerned about. Okay, I think we're good. Give me a horizontal. Give me a, a left up. Boom. Come on, we got this by the fucking ace. Give me that vertical, and then give me an up left. You like how I just uh, put names to these things? I need a down right. I need an up left. <laughs> First aid kit. First aid kit. Boom. Now, I don't know why that alarm is going off. Unless there's fuckers in here, and I own that camera, which is probably the case. Are you dead? You are now. <laughs> I don't trust like that. Here we go, here we go. The Warcraft didn't get himself that. You got something from me and my crew? Or are you just looking to get criticized? You sit here a spell. I need to set on some coffee. Maybe put on silverware and the like. <laughs> What the fuck are you talking about? 
Before you head into the fisheries, a word to the wise. All PG seems about as straight as a dog's hind leg. You keep your eyes open. Yeah, we're gonna have to take care of this fucker. Nobody walks into my swampy carry and I eat. Put your weapons in the new hole, and then I'll let you in. Oh, this guy wants us to put all of our weapons away. If that's his price, you're gonna have to pay us. But he can't very well take your plasma away now, can he? Ah, I like the way Atlas thinks. What is this? I got incinerate. You don't you think I didn't come prepared? Focused hacker. That is going to help. That's gonna, I think, fewer fried circuits. So you know those ones that were totally broken out and we couldn't use them? There will be fewer of those. That's very useful. First aid kit is gonna come in handy later. How about it? Dan Dan's, before we put all of our weapons away and head into Fontaine Fisheries, I think that's a good place to call it a day here on Bioshock Episode 2. I hope you guys are enjoying this show as much as I am. Until next week, I love you, and I'll see you soon.